What up guys, James here, aka The Pop, and today I'm going to continue why I started two or three weeks ago, which is create a series of videos that are not sponsored, unfucked with, videos about what I consider to be my favorite articles of clothing, brands of clothing, like particularly certain models of clothing. And so last time we talked about my favorite t-shirt, which was the American Apparel Power Wash tee, and we're really just creating this series to essentially convey to you guys my personal favorites because too much on YouTube, you get these like kind of sponsored, these funded videos where they're paying people to just tell you that like, oh, I, this is my favorite brand, this is my favorite gold, this is really cool, this is trending. When it's complete bullshit, they're just trying to sell you something. And I just wanted to be honest with you guys and like show you guys my minimalist, like streetwear-esque uh, type of style and really just primarily give you guys my opinion and hopefully kind of introduce you to like a few new things. Um, so today we're going to talk about denim and primarily we'll stick around kind of like salvage denim and stay within that arena of type of jeans because I do wear non salvage and I will show you like one or two pairs, one pair of non salvage, but for the most part I do wear salvage denim. Now I'm not a denim head in any like by any definition of it. I do not consider myself and I proactively, proactively do not consider myself one because I mean, I don't live and die by denim. I respect it. I think there are certain beautiful types of fabric. I appreciate like certain rare fabrics, but I don't think it's a all in one thing. I don't think it can make your outfit. I don't think you should be defined by the type of denim you wear. But of course we will stick to or I have dabbled in and we will mention some of the more dedicated uh, brands, what, what I consider to be dedicated, which is like Railcar, Roy, um, basically anything they sell at Self Edge. But and at the same time, we're not going to talk about like shit like Salmon for Our Mankind, like that kind of like BS of true religion, like th those are just ir irrelevant, basic as fuck, and we're not going to talk about those. But so I'll go straight into it. My favorite pair of jeans is actually. APC, like petite new standard, um, and also kind of sometimes the petite standard, switching between the two. The petite standard being my slim esque um, fit one, and then the petite new standard being the skinny fit. And that's what I prefer. I wear like skinny jeans all the time. That's what I'm accustomed to. That's what I grew up with. And luckily, as an engineer, I can still wear jeans to work, and this is what I wear. And so, this is what I'm talking about here. This is literally your average APC petite standard pair of selvage indigo jeans. Very simple, extremely minimal. I mean, it has like a very um, aqua-esque like indigo dye versus some of like the other cones mill like type of American denim, which is like a very true blue. This one is an aqua type of feel. Um, you have a very simple like Sewing, no like no fancy embroideries of any kind of all, no decoration. You have your standard red line selvage. This is 14 ounces, 100% cotton, and I mean, as simple as it gets. Not loud at all. Looks nice. Looks clean. You'll notice that it does have like a little bit of like kind of looseness to it still, cause because this is the slimmer fit. And I would say that I would honestly say I have a pretty like standard normal medium like build not muscular in any sort of way but also not like super skinny so if you are on the skinniest side then yes like you will have quite a bit more room but if you do work out like harrison you're gonna fill these pretty damn quick and these are a 29 hem to a 29 i typically have my jeans hem to a 29 28 which is my true size um unrolled they will sit on top of my feet um and yeah i mean it's pretty straightforward now with a pair of petite new standards, as you can see, the fit is significantly different. It's much skinnier, has a very skinny like fit to it, similar to the um, petite standards in the thigh, but much skinnier through the legs. You also notice these are not hem jet, I've just been too lazy. These are the stone washed um, denims. Um, also salvage um, has a red line, but also because it's been stone washed faded, it turns into like a pink line salvage. Uh, still 14 ounces, 100% cotton, so you get a nice like stiff feel to it. You have a nice fit, but unlike the jeans with like spandex in them, they don't just like fall on you. They still have a stiffness, they still have a nice like way to the to a kind of way in which they sit on your body. 
which is what I like. Very simple, of course, again, and I believe these are not seasonal. These are also one of the common uh, APC uh, jeans you will find. And I mean, I like the fit because I mean, it's a true like skinny fit, but it's not overly tight. You don't see it grabbing like my calves. You don't see it really expanding out here once it hits the calves area because with people who are, I mean, a mixture of it, if you are too fat for skinny jeans and jeans that are too skinny, you see it kind of bulge out again. You see this kind of like inwards and then outwards, which is disgusting. Um, but you won't really find that issue here. And so that's really why I like the APCs. They keep a good true um, like skinny fit to them while still maintaining the stiffness and kind of like what you like out of a salvage jeans. Now we're gonna talk about some other jeans now. Now these are my Railcar Spikes X001. These are probably the most denim head-esque pair of jeans I own. Kind of like from a very small shop down in LA, each handmade, these were custom made for me to my sizing. And so, I mean, what I'm saying is I received them, no need to get them hemmed, they're already fitting. And they cost still about the same price as like the APC Petite New Standards, but there is that huge convenience and coolness of buying it from a small shop, supporting a very small business and knowing exactly what you're getting. These are American cone mills. Uh, I believe these are 13 ounce. Uh, I might be wrong, but they're a little bit like lighter than the AP, um, APC uh, Petite New Standards, but they still sit nicely, still 100% cotton. There's no spandex in them. And these actually are probably the loosest jeans I own. Now the, they have their own aesthetic. I still really like them. I've had them for like three years now, repaired them like three times crotch blocks every single time and I love them but in all truth I wear my APC Petite like new standards much much more I just like the fit on them more I like the way they sit they go better with like all the other like tops I own and it's just easier to wear it fits my minimalist style like much more but this one is not still still very simple very minimal like but has small little things dual tone stitching chain stitching up the ass like everything like Everything's there, but not there to be seen, just like there for the quality of the jeans. Now for some more affordable options, of course, Uniqlo is always a good way to go. I mean, they release like salvage ranging from 50 bucks and like under, I believe. And like with the, comparing to the petite standards, their tapered salvage is as close as you'll get. I mean, this thing fits almost identically. And compared to the petite new standards, then the new um, stretch selvage would be definitely the way to go. Now the issue is that these fit awesome, they're very cheap, but they have spandex in them, which may be convenient if you're trying to fit into a, jeans that, a pair of jeans that are too small for you. But the thing is, it affects the way it falls, and I do not like the weight of this fabric and how it like, falls on my body. It seems like it's just floating around rather than having any sort of stiffness to it. But for 50 bucks a piece and also giving you the opportunity to get it hemmed in store is unbelievable. If you're trying to just get the cheapest pair possible for the, like, for the best, for the cheapest, then probably Uniqlo is the way to go. And I mean, in all truth, like, I mean, yeah, this thing's cool about like Roar, this cool things about Iron Hearts, like 21 ounce, like, like denim, like those are like novelties, but it's not practical. I mean, the way I style myself is very minimal, very practical. And very simple and the APC petite standards and the petite new, petite new standards best fit it they're not the best jeans but they are my favorite so hope you guys got something out of this video just want to go ahead and put my opinion out there be honest with you guys and hopefully we'll do this again in the future